sponsored by Jeans Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram, the official dealership of Life in Alaska. From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. Today is Friday, March 22nd, 2013. In the news this time, uh, an Alaska House panel today takes up a bill that would require public school teachers to work a couple more years before they could acquire tenure rights. The measure says teachers be employed in the same district continuously for five school years or accept a teacher contract for six consecutive school years to be eligible for tenure. Currently, teachers who work for three continuous years or accept a four-year contract can get tenure. Alaska lawmakers plan to take a closer look at security at the state capitol. Representative Mike Hawker, chairman of the Legislative Council, says he'll appoint a subcommittee to study the issue. He said any issues surrounding security would be taken up during executive session due to the sensitive nature of that issue. The city of Valdez plans to spend up to $900,000 to drum up opposition to a bill for an in-state gas natural pipeline project. City manager John Hosey says a large-scale line and project capable of overseas exports makes more sense for Alaska. Valdez hopes to be the terminus for a major line. And Fairbanks Drama Association is bringing back a fan favorite production as part of their 50th anniversary celebration season. Tonight they unveil their latest production of Smokey Joe's Cafe. Performances are scheduled March 22nd through April 7th. Friday and Saturday evening performances at 8.15. Saturday and Sunday matinees at 2 p.m. All showings are at the Hap Rider Riverfront Theater and you can call 456-PLAY for reservations. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather. Today, mostly cloudy, chance of snow, highs in the mid to upper 20s. Tonight, snow likely with areas of fog and lows around one above. Tomorrow, chance of snow in the morning and then partly sunny in the afternoon, highs in the mid-teens. Extended outlook is not much change for several days. Air index is moderate in Fairbanks, good in North Pole, and aurora activity is forecast to be low. And that's all we have for right now. Thanks for joining us. Remember, for more news, sports, or weather, you can download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.